Hey guys, I know I told you guys a week ago that I was going to post up two reviews and I'm really sorry that I haven't done them yet and so I'm doing, I'm posting up both reviews this week so the first one of course is the e.l.f. primer review and um, this is what it looks like in the box and obviously I've taken out the box already because I used it. I've used it quite a bit. So here it is. This is what it looks like and we open it up. Looks like this, kind of like a lip gloss wand, and um, yeah, it doesn't smell that, it smells like paint. <laughs> I always have to smell things. Anyways, uh, so yeah, I did get this from, I got this for a dollar from Target, and I was really excited to try this because I've seen like Wifey Val use it a few times in her video, so I was like, I have to try this out and see like, is it comparable to Urban Decay? And I would definitely say that it is comparable to Urban Decay because it does the job. I mean, that's all that I can ask for. Does it do the job? So, it definitely keeps my eyeshadow on all day. And how I know that it definitely stands the test is I wear this when I go to the gym sometimes. And I do Zumba class, which is like this crazy, like cardio latin dancing class and i'm like sweating so much and it's gross and i'm like oh my god it's so hot and then like I come out my hair is looking crazy but like my eyeshadow stays on even though i've been like sweating and then even all the way to the nighttime right before i go to bed like, my eyeshadow still looks really really good so still looks exactly how i did it in the morning so i mean what more can you ask for how a consistency compares to urban decay's primer i would say that it's thinner and it's like more silky feels more creamy to me and um, that's not a bad thing at all just if you're going to compare consistency so that's what I would say um but I would definitely say that I was surprised that a little bit really goes a long way with this because when I take it out of when I take it out like this see how there's like a big clump well I don't use that I actually like take the excess off and then I'll apply because um, if you actually like just apply a little too much, it's like too much for reals and then you have all this excess that you're trying to get off and then it just looks like white and crazy. Um, it says that it's sheer, but like I wouldn't say it's super sheer. Like for my skin tone, um, when I put it on it makes my eyelids look like pretty white. So I have to put on like appearance stuff. I definitely have to put on shadow that's like matches my skin tone. But yeah, other than that, I don't have any complaints about it. I really don't. And I'm very, very excited, especially that it only costs one dollar. So now I'm probably not gonna be buying Urban Decay anymore. I'm really sorry, Urban Decay. I love you guys, but I can't pay twenty dollars when I can pay one dollar and I can just go get it from Target. So yeah, I'm very, very excited about it. Don't have any bad things to say, and yeah, I hope that helped you guys out. So if you're considering trying this, I would definitely say go try it because I don't have any complaints about it. I'll show you guys my shirt also. I'll just show you. It's like it has like studs and beads and a chain. I really really like the shirt. Um, I got the shirt like a year or two ago. Or I call it like my Lady Gaga shirt. Um, like Lady Gaga when she first came out, not Lady Gaga now, of course. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, stay tuned for my other videos, and I am going to be posting up other kinds of videos that aren't beauty related. They're actually going to be like more on like the funny side, um, just me making fun of certain people about <laughs> certain things in everyday life. So anyways, make sure you guys stay tuned for those. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any comments, write me down below. I love hearing everything you guys have to say. Uh, that's it. <laughs> Bye.